Hey together, Aaron the Black Dragon's back! And welcome all of you to another episode of October's Out... Uh, not Outlast, wrong game! Amnesia! So, last episode we got into... What I'd call is a little bit of a pickle. We are right in this room where the hole is. Which we probably need a shovel for the dig through. But outside... There was the grunt last episode. I'm pretty sure that he's gone by now. But we still need to be careful because running into the ground, not a good thing. Taking that with us. See nothing around here. Placing you there. The Danadum and oil. Exquisite. We are slowly getting up to what we need. Being careful, having my chair with me. Just in case we need some throwable material. And uh, it's locked. One of the lock princesses has a weak lock. Um, no. No. How are the lock is corroded and weak? Okay. Might come in handy. Okay, nothing there. My chair. Uh, there is a reserve chair. Thank you. Where that... is she? Yeah. Where did she go? Going over there. No. Oh, tell. I'll never tell you. You're just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. So, are we the good guys? I don't know. Monster? No. Good. Um, this is... a chipper. Okay. Taking you with me again. Good thing to have around if we wanna... throw it at someone. Ha! That worked. So... That's exquisite. Half lantern. Oh, that's exactly what we needed there. So we have bones. It said something about the bones earlier. I heard something about bo bones at least. Can pull that around. It's just that. Nothing there. Another chair. A few drops of oil. Give me them. Because sure, why not? What am I doing with bones? I don't know, but I got lantern oil from, from that, so light that up so that I may find it again in case we need it. There's another chair, there's oil on that chair, yes please, now I have some in reserve if I need to refill. I still have the hammer that I don't know what I'm needing it for. Okay. Not good, not good, not good. Gonna take short breather inside of this death trap. But there is something. I don't know what I need to think about that. But there's something coming this way. Yep, there's something. Turn on the light. Just to come down a bit. Hi there. Shit. Go away. Go away. There was someone. Seems to be kind of blind. Also, what does my sanity say? Probably not too good for me to be around him. So I still need something to get down there. Narrow path to slip through that. Haha. -ha. That worked. 
So, the dark towers of Brandenburg rose above the forest that was silhouetted against the snow white moon. How could. He couldn't help feeling sad for some reason. Uh, I have a few reasons to feel sad, to be totally honest. Okay, so I had everything that I needed and decided to go back just to have a little bit of action. Sure, why not? Sometimes that's good. Ah. Yeah, sure. Let's go right. Conditioned by video games. Always go to the right. The right is... Openable. Okay, um, what does the left say then? I have my reserve oil so I can spare the time. We cannot run. Probably because we're crouched. What is on this side? This side is blocked. Good. We went the right side, so conditioning actually for the win. I wanted just to make sure because I don't want to miss out on something. Like we probably already did. Because I just went forward. And... Get over there. Push you out. Oh, nice rock. Gonna take that with me as well. Hmm. But there's a few things that I could say about this place. Not nice things, that is. But a few things. I have my rock. And if something's coming our way, that's bound to do something for us. Ain't it? Don't necessarily want to run around. Okay. I thought something was coming my way, but apparently not. Colin. Nothing there, nothing there. There's a. Okay. Something splashing around here. Not liking the sounds of that. Need to be careful. Because if there's something running around. Is he safe? Well, it's for his own good. Who is he? Who's own good? What am I actually trying to find right now? I'm here. Intrude is something, but that's blocked off. But this it's in the back. It's in the box. No momentous are available, so I don't even know what I'm trying to do right now. Sooner will be ready. Let okay. there be enough time. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Nay, not good. Hey, you! Stop! Don't come any closer. I just want to leave. You can't go outside. It's too dangerous. I'm telling Gabriel. I doubt that very much. He escaped? Where is he now? Who is he? Why are we trying to keep her? Ah, don't touch. Maybe my rock! Nay. Not even my rock will help me with that. It is locked with a padlock from the other side, but I think that's actually where I tried to get through before. Might that be a thing? Hmm. Gonna take something lighter with me, like a box. I know a bolt is probably more apt to deal with monsters. Oh god. Okay, there's something coming our way. I'm gonna use that. Give me a short second. Okay. So there's probably no way for me to get in there. No. Something's coming our way. Oh, no longer. He's over there. Good to know. Well, I had my box and my running shoes ready, so... No real harm would have become... Would have come over us, but whatever. Good to know that he decided not to bother me... Today. So we are now officially in monster infested areas. There's a padlock, so no way to go there. Ah, oh, damn, which way did you go? I'm gonna go this way. And if I run towards you... Which I suspect I did. You're gonna get a box full of... A fistful of box, I mean. 
Huh, you seem to have seen better days. Picked up some oil. Still going good on that. Uh, tinderbox, hi. No jump scare, good. Anything else that looks interesting in here? And says no. Oh, that's not good. I don't know what you did. You went into a burning house, that's all I get from that. I get my box with me. Because it may come in handy. Oh, there's an open one. Oh, good. Putting that away, there's something to read. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. I mean, how would you know that, to be totally frank, how would you know that it's your fault? You just happen to be in a bad spot. That's not good. I need to be careful. I should not look at it too much. But it's right on the other side. And if it's deciding to come down here then... That might be a problem. Still there? I have my box in front of me so that I can throw it at you. If need be. But I think that you are actually gone. At least think so. I'm ready to put on my running shoes, by the way. And I have a box. I'm doubly safe from you. Or so I tell myself. I might actually be not safe at all from you. Which may seem more likely. But I have my running shoes. And therefore I don't care. Because I already ran you beforehand, so... I know... Whoops! Don't care about you. Are you gonna come my way? If so, you're gonna have a problem. Yep, you come my way. Need to <sighs> make a stand here for a moment and probably refill that. Torch that up. And I'm gonna wait here for a little bit because if he's gonna come this way, I'm gonna try to run past him. That's my that's my plan right now. If he's not gonna come this way, then I can just move forward. But if he's coming this way, I'm passing by him. So I'm ready. But I don't hear him. So moving on. I have a box and I have my running shoes. Box and running shoes. That's all I need. And more nerves because they are a little bit blank right now. Oh god, he's a running. He's a running back. Whoa, boy! No, 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 I'm back. Hi. Ah, one batch. I pressed. Whoops. I'm sorry. I pressed tab, and that happened. 
How did that happen? That's not... That's not okay. Also, I think I was just going back to the beginning, so... Yeah, that's my box. Give me my box back. Ah... That's not good. I was... Hmm... No! I shouldn't have died there. That's not... That's not good for a psyche. But I should... I shouldn't have died there. I should have been fine. I should have gotten away from him. 3rd of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates, gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenburg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Just in time for what? Is there like a candle I can light or something? Because I don't want to waste my oil sitting inside of here. There's a bucket! My sanity! I feel like I'm always the same page of my san... Oh. Hi, how about I close that and... Whoop, take my leaf! Over yonder. Oh god, my sanity. I have controls of nothing. I feel like I'm a flea ball. But there's another monster in here. Oh, I was like, oh, there's a monster right in front of me. Also, no. Can my sanity please, 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 a little bit at least, come back to me? I don't like. I don't like it when my sanity is like complete garbage. Makes this incredibly hard to control. Oh no, I'm back there already. Uh, that's not good. Do I have another oil? No, I'm running out of oil again. Which is not the best thing. Not the best thing. Totally not. What am I actually trying to find? The key? I think I'm trying to find the key. So... Oh! Hi, my sanity is completely garbled, so how about you don't run after me? I can't see anything. Whoa! You missed me, buddy! I ran past you because I'm a spoofy one. I can't see Jack. And you can't hit Jack, so I think I'm in the running for being better than you. And... Ouch, gonna have to make a... Hi! Running past you, running right through you. If I'm gonna die here again, then that's okay with me because my sanity is gonna kill me anyway in a moment. So, uh, I don't see what I'm doing. Where is my. Uh, there is my death. I have to carry on. I will carry on because I need to be something to do. But I'm pretty sure where it crosses over this is where I need to go. Would you stop grunting? Oh, oil. I'm taking that for sure. Because boy knows I need some oil. And some matchbox. Tinder boxes. Oh, I crouched apparently. I got in here. Huh. So this is where he was inside. When I opened it up last time. Is he gonna be there again? If so, have a chair. 
And with a chair comes great power. Okay, there's yes that padlock. So I think I'm on the right way now. You wait here. Okay, looks good. Make safe that nothing comes after me. Is this? I'm gonna collect everything else because pretty sure I'm gonna die again once I hit that important thing over there. Okay. A glass jar. Good. What am I supposed to do with a glass jar? Seems to be nothing else of interest in here. So all I can do now is move on. But I don't know. We have a glass jar. We can do stuff. Place you right there. I'm gonna close that up. And go up here. <sighs> Seriously. Does this have to be a thing? One month of us. A lot less of a problem. And he's just annoying. But seriously, what am I to do? I have no mementos available. What am I to do with a glass jar? I only saw that one padlock door. <sighs> I really have no clue what I'm trying to do right now. I have no idea what I'm trying to accomplish here. But sitting around in here won't help me, so... Taking my chair... And probably gonna go ahead and die again? Maybe an option. Maybe an option. But what... What is it I'm trying to accomplish right now? That's the big question I have. What does a glass bottle do for me? I've went all the way. I've been everywhere. I just assume I need to go in here. Very poor condition. Wait, does that mean I can just... No, the padlock won't break. It needs to be weakened further. So that means I need to find some kind of acid that doesn't it okay whatever I'm gonna do this because I think if I'm just letting this game run now good chances are that the ground is gonna find me so I'm gonna leave this episode right here next episode we're gonna try to find some acid I guess somewhere around here I don't know so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did how about leaving a comment down below I really would appreciate that and hope to see all of you to the next part of October's amnesia so, bye!